top of the time zone to you it's freddie j here with freddie j sports and we are back appreciate everybody for coming out as we are playing nascars 06 total team controls fight to the top mode but it's 2023 y'all like this kind of content make sure y'all like comment and subscribe we last left off doing our showdown at devil's canyon with elliot sattler uh we won also, uh, we had the terrible races at Bristol that uh, kind of annoyed me, and now we're going to try to make up for that at Richmond. Let's look at our standings, even though it doesn't really matter for both the series we're about to run. But... We're 27th, and we're not that far off from everybody else. So let's hope that Richmond gives us some good news here. We're going to go ahead and qualify and then do a race. And then we have three races to go for the Wheel and Modified Tour. And we're going on the road course of Old Spice. So let's go ahead and get going and do the truck series first. Really looking forward to this because I feel like we're getting back on track no pun intended in regards of us getting back in i don't i wouldn't say in contention because we're still a thousand points away but with tracks like this i feel pretty confident in let's go ahead and qualify we're not going to waste a lot of time practicing here short track racing is pretty much our bread and butter at this point even though we got screwed out of a possible win at Bristol. And and that's not our fault. We did a great job pitting and everything. Well, we get a we did a great job moving our way up to the front, but then our pit crew just fumbled. We couldn't really escape from that. So we are about to enter turn three. Currently on good pace. We might get the pole as long as uh, we stay off the wall. All right, we got it. No, no need to play around here. 21-2. I definitely feel like we have an opportunity here to make sure... We can definitely take over this race. Plain and simple. Simple and plain. All right. Meanwhile, the chase is about to start for the next tow cup. I should probably keep an eye on that. I don't even know who's uh, actually up there, but... Two wins, two top fives. Well, sorry, three top fives and five top tens for us in the Rossing Racing uh, 105 car. We're hoping to improve on that today here at Richmond. Good evening, race fans, and welcome to the Richmond International Raceway as EA Sports presents the NASCAR Craftsman Truck Series 200. It's just three quarters of a mile around this place, but don't let that fool you. Richmond has a smooth surface, multiple racing grooves, and plenty of banking in the turns to provide a great setup for any racing series. The stars of the Craftsman Truck Series have their work cut out for them. This should be a tight battle right to the checkered flag, and maybe even longer. All right, you heard the man. And it turns out we're actually in the 103 car. I couldn't tell because the number was bunched up. But green flags in the air. Starting extremely low and looks like, whoa. Already a caution. My goodness. Terrible restart there. What was that? Was not expecting that right out the gate. Alright. Oh, man. 
why is our car all of a sudden tight? What happened to my car I had in qualifying? Oh my goodness. There we go. Alright, so this car must be terrible at the restarts because uh, that was horrible. Man, I cannot be racing like without full throttle. I need I need to go and hit the gas. Too high. I don't think we're gaining any ground right now. We're just like at a stalemate at six. been at one and a half for a while we're actually fading we make up some ground right there but it's not enough ten to go we gained a second there Man, that car is way too loose. So Ricky Craven's already up in the third. Man, we really need to pit bad. Try to get uh, two more laps and lap them all. Whoa. Got to get that extra lap in on them. Whoa. Oh no, that was terrible. Oh man, we hate that. I have no choice but the pit. Good gracious, our wedge was that much? Let's go ahead and get fresh tires and everything. Come on, let's go. Y'all better make up for what happened Oh, I'm still in the lead. Let's go. I'm ahead by a whole lap. Great strategy on my part. Whoa, somebody got hit big time against that wall right there.
This car is running just fine. Okay, maybe a little bit too much turn on that exit. I've lapped the entire field. Okay. All right, here we go. One to go. Goodness, my bad. Well, we got the win in an unconventional matter. I really wanted to just body slam Ricky Craven, but it's fine. Another win in the books for Freddy. Started on the pole, finished on the pole, pretty much lapped the entire field. Let two cars get by us, but everybody else was lapped down. Shout out to the pit crew today. I mean, granted, there were a non factor. What? I think I'm clipping through the wall. I think I've blown the engine. Yeah, George Teague is definitely mad at us. My bad. Let's look at that highlight reel. That's us winning. Trying to figure out when was this. Yeah, I think this was when I was lapping down everybody. Again, these highlight reels are not doing, doing us any favors right here. Way to get that dub, though. What kind of tantrum my guy is throwing? Like, what was that? Ew. Brother, ew. I bet that's them. Hey, dude, I don't know what happened out there on that track. I was getting a pedicure from a bikini model, but wow, you have got hey, a hot under the collar. He called me up, 
looking for you. Now, I don't know what to tell him, so uh, why don't you let me know what to say when I get back to him? I'll apologize to him, because I ain't trying to have no beef. But let's look at the standings now after that race. We didn't necessarily dominate, but uh, we was up in the front. We was running top 10 for the most of the race, despite uh, having our issues at the both the restarts. So, yeah, let's look at the standings here. Oh, that's a big creep up. We are in the top 20, just like that. Out of nowhere, too. That That is... That is crazy. We're now under a thousand points back. So big, big news right there. Meanwhile, Jimmy Johnson is going to start uh, on the, the first position for the next Hell Cups. Ryan Newman, Kyle, and Kurt Busch still at it. Brian Vickers is still here in 2023. Carl Edwards in 2023. Patrick Fitzgerald, that's a new driver. Elliot Sadler, Martin Truex, Matt Kenseth. And that's the 10. Travis Koppel, Shane Demiel, Casey Kane, Kevin Harvick, Peter Wells. I think Dale Jr. retired. Yeah, Dale Jr. was not in it. Uh, I think Dale Jr. retired uh, the last year. So, yeah, some of those big names. I'm surprised a lot of these big names are still... I mean, the... The core actually is still racing. Brian Vickers, Carl Edwards are the only Elliot Sadler. Martin Truex actually, as I'm uh, speaking right now, this is his actual last year in 2024. Uh, Matt Kenseth, I think, retired a couple years ago. Or I, I don't know. It, it, I haven't been keeping up with actual NASCAR like that, but I know that was one of the big things that... Um, one of his last races, I think he spun out Joey Logano or something like that. It was crazy. Meanwhile, uh, we're about to head back and do the Wheel and Modified. As we're three races to go. As uh, Jimmy Johnson wins the Sylvania 300 at New Hampshire. So far, nine wins and five top. Uh, sorry, nine wins and eleven top fives. We're gonna try to make that ten and twelve today. At one of the one of the more difficult tracks for us here, and that's the Old Spice. The Old Spice Speedway is yeah. proud to present today's running of the Cherry Blossom 100. Considered a driver and fan favorite. This track provides the backdrop for one of the most anticipated races of the NASCAR Wheel and Modified Series season. EA Sports is proud to bring you the racing action and the start is just moments away. All right, so I'm gonna try to see if uh, I could do something about this. Uh... Nice. All right, let's go ahead and qualify. Two laps around here. I remember when I used to use Old Spice. Trying to figure out where this racetrack is. Like, most of these racetracks I know are quote-unquote fictional, but some of them I feel like are actually real. Let 
gonna probably talk about this. I'm trying to get back on Reddit. So that's gonna be interesting. I'm looking at my computer like uh, I have the chat up here as if I was streaming this. I'm actually not streaming this, but here we go. Green flag. Already not doing so well. There we go. Good turn right there. all what it comes down to. All right. Replace ninth. It's going to all come down to this. Stay on your line. Hey, I'll take it. We're up towards the front. Top ten start. Let's hope we got a top 10 car. And here we go. Green flag's about to drop. And we're on our way. Great restart. Already jumped up three positions. With three races to go. Whoa. Whoa. Big hit. We really don't need to race these these because we pretty much clinched it. It's just a five lap race. One eighty eight is blocking, but let's see how long is that gonna last. This is definitely a track I'm gonna have to use my brakes on. We take the lead there. I don't think you're getting it back, buddy. That turn we could have been a little bit looser on. So we got three laps to go. So far, we're going to... Get away here. Meanwhile, let's go check on the rest of the field. Whoa, the one fifty three was not giving me any room. Great move. Oh, man. We're just hauling now. Whoa. 
Excuse me, you're gonna follow. We got one to go. All right, one to go. Oh, man. One to go. We're inside the car. I don't think anyone's touching us. We've just been pretty dominant. Once we got up to the front, no one's really been uh, able to challenge us. Just one big turn right here, and this is it. And there's your winner. Oh, that's a joke because of what I did last time. Let's go check out this back this track backwards. Hmm, yes. Give a little tour. the bridge the pit road You get the point. I think I spent too much time on... I think I spent too much time on the victory celebration. I was like, yeah, I need to go ahead and get going if I wanted to do one more race. And uh, due to the conditions of of where we are in the stands in the craftsman truck. See, the craftsman truck, we, we definitely have the chance to come back from based on that. Uh, let's go ahead and look at the standings for the Wheel of Modified Tour. Nothing much is going to change as we just got our 10th win of the season. Check our standings. Ryan Newman currently in second. Kurt Busch third. Kyle Busch fourth. Yeah, we're 420 points ahead. We could literally just skip the last two if we wanted to. So, one of the things that are one of the things that is usually an issue with this game is the conflicting schedules. Or if you have drivers that would normally do double duty, you you can't. You, I've seen people they were like, "Oh, let's take a helicopter and fly over to that racetrack so you can race there. Uh, apparently, we don't have the money despite we having $2 million to do that. But, uh, so, they're gonna be in California. I'm actually gonna race in New Hampshire for the simple reason of we're that close. And besides, these, the races we're having at the Bush National Series are like yes that'll be some great XP 
but if we have a shot to try to get a crack at the title, I'm going for it. Uh, let's go ahead and sign some autographs. If you're liking what you're seeing so far, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. All right, let's get it. Circle, square, circle, triangle, circle, triangle, triangle, square, circle, 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 cross. Go to the square hole. Wow, a perfect 40 out of 40. It goes in the square hole. So far, our career in the Craftsman Truck Series, we started late, late, but uh, three wins, four top fives, and six top tens. Pretty solid day. We just come off of a win, too. Our third win was really at Richmond earlier this vid. I I'm still shocked that we was able to pull that off, but uh, let's go ahead and qualify. It's New Hampshire. This is where they were just racing at for the Cup Series. Uh, that's where Jimmy Johnson won. If you saw the results there, I know I, uh, I, I, I did mention it, but uh, it, it, it didn't sink in. Like it was just a blur. I know it's only been 30 minutes, but it's just been a blur, and we've just been trying to push out. It, it's just a lot. Because I looked at the point standings and I was like, yeah, we could definitely make a run for the top 10 points. And New Hampshire is that track where uh, I've had great success before in the Cup Series uh, when I was younger, when I was playing this. Though Dover, the next track, would uh, erase all my, all my progress. And... Uh, I've been actually listening to uh, a few of the videos of the 2006 season. And yeah, we made the poll. I don't need to qualify again. Like, what, come on now. Let's, let's, let's not waste time here. Like, I like my car. Feels good. I know how to drive this racetrack. What's the problem? Carl Edwards is going to win the Bush Series. The Bush Series 300. I, I, That is funny. That is funny. They can call it that, but they can't call it the Bush Series on... I guess if it's subtle, you wouldn't know. It was real finicky about that. EA Sports and the New Hampshire International Speedway welcome you as we get ready for the Sylvania 200 in the scenic city of Loudoun. The Craftsman Truck Series makes its annual Loudon. stop at New Hampshire as these drivers prepare for what should be a race with plenty of excitement. When 36 of the world's fastest trucks take to the track in New Hampshire, you're sure to see your share of bent fenders. Today should be no different, and the drop of the green flag is just moments away. And here's moments later. And we're green. I don't think this car has is great on acceleration. But uh, we're hanging tough. Can we leave the first lap? Oh, whoa, big wreck right behind us. All righty then. This time, we wasn't at fault. What happened here? Oh, somebody just got dumped. I, I don't know what happened there. Why is your sponsor outtake intake systems? That makes no sense. 
Uh, cue the random cutscene. All right, here we go. The 18, whoa, just spun me out that time. All righty then, this is how we're gonna play, huh? Just went and swooped underneath me. All right. <sighs> Two instant costumes right here. Where'd the 18 go? Bro just disappeared, just went straight up high side and disappeared. Alrighty then. But I'll finally uh, get the lead and I'm starting to run away with it. Maybe I'm just bad at uh, restarts right now. This car isn't built for it. It probably just takes uh literally a turn to get through it as uh, we're starting to move away currently a second back I remember I would just usually be on the inside and just run it now I'm actually uh, playing it with the racetrack I'm actually about to start running away now. Look at us carrying on. I don't want to swap to anybody yet. If I could at least lead... Right, now I'm gonna start conserving now. Whoa, okay, I guess I can't uh, back this down too much. Ten to go. No green flag pit stops yet. Better move the ease off there. It may be gaining ground off me because I'm exiting these a little bit, but uh, I don't think they're gonna get to me that easy. I'm gonna try to lap everybody. Hitting next time by. Right sides. There we go. Come on.
Come on, let's go. Right sides only. Let's go. Alright, let's get it. We're free. Great pit stop, team. We finally got some good green flag pit stops. That's just what we needed to keep leading this race. Yeah, we're just dominating right now. Bit of stalling. <laughs> I don't think our tires are going to be an issue here. Just want to hold up the field and just dominate. A few times when I swap cars, all of a sudden my driver decides to just spin out and a caution won't come out. And uh, yeah, I end up DNFing uh, when I played this game before. So that's why I'm like, normally I would be switching to help others, but like at a time like this where I could have a chance to get inside the top 10 in the, the standings for the whole series, yeah, I'm going to go for it. With two laps to go. We're really just, we'd really just been dominating. We, This car was made for green green flag runs, and it, it, it shows right here. About to be five seconds now. You don't even have to worry about gas. We could just drive this thing no one's gonna stop us unless the caution wants to come out before I hit the stripe right here and it's not so yeah we're, we're as long as our tires don't blow or in our, or anything we should be good to win the checkered that's gonna be our third win of the video Gonna do a little bit of a celebration here as yours truly, Freddie J, wins at New Hampshire. Um, I'm sorry, but who are you? What a win! Again, another. 50 minute video in the books I'm not sure if y'all want it back to 30 but uh, the way we've been running lately hey I, I gotta get I gotta give the pit crew love this time All the love to the pit crew here. Yeah, you get the point. So another day, another race in the books. Look at us dominating throughout the entire thing. I wish our hood could stay clean, but it's whatever. 
back-to-back -back wins. Who would who, who would have thought? Who would have thought? Now we head over to Victory Lane. We got 4K from our waste winnings. Not bad. Oh, great. Somebody's mad again. Are they trying to do the homie? Because I, I don't I don't think that's how you do it. Oh, man. We're definitely going to have to look at the standings after that and apologize uh, to uh, Ace Moneymaker, but not the guy because I don't know what his problem is. We might get a raise soon. Well, with the way we've been running, we might as well. Hey, dude. Yeah, we don't care. Uh, So... We have five more races left. This time, we're at Vegas uh, for the Craftsman Truck Series. We're probably going to skip Richmond due to the severity of the possibility for us winning uh, a championship. We'll be back in October for Dover. One of the most difficult racetracks I've ever had to deal with. We're going to have to face from the back as, uh, well, actually, no, we, we don't. We could totally just skip this. We could literally skip this race, honestly, for the Wheel of Modified. It, it's not a factor. But let's look at the standings real quick. Now, 13th, 958 points back. Still don't know where Terry Cook is, but I don't care. We're, we're, we may not win, but we've did a lot of improvement to get ourselves from 35th to just about in the top 10 if we can get, get past uh, Bill Lester. It's uh, 120 points. We're behind them. But uh, I'm feeling confident we could do something about it. So appreciate everybody for coming out. If y'all like this kind of content, make sure y'all like, comment, and subscribe. And as always, I'm Freddie J. Y'all have a good day and a better tomorrow.